We'll find out tomorrow if union workers accept what Metro Transit is calling its best and final offer. 2,500 bus drivers, light rail operators, and mechanics are threatening a strike when mass transit is needed the most. That is, of course, when the Twin Cities host the Super Bowl on February 4th. But as Bill Hudson explains, most feel the deal they are voting on will likely avoid that. As Vikings fans flood into U.S. Bank Stadium feeling the Super Bowl fever, Metro Transit workers queue up for a crucial vote. It's never easy. What the 2,500 union members decide will be the difference between a Super Bowl snarl or super relief. Union President Mark Lawson calls it a fair deal. You know, we didn't get everything we wanted. They didn't get everything they wanted, and we, we made a good compromise. For more than six months, contract talks were going nowhere. So in November, union members authorized a strike. But shutting down Metro Transit during the Super Bowl would have been catastrophic. It was the push both sides needed. The thought of a bitter strike in bitter weather is very much on the minds of those voting. Because we all have bills to pay. Bills, bills don't stop when you're out on strike, so that, that would be the last thing that, that all of us would want. A proposed three-year deal increases wages 2.5% a year, but more importantly, it begins to address the union's concern for driver's safety. It's been an issue forever. 20-year driver Ed Selinski wants to see protective shields in all buses. Metro Transit will begin by experimenting with 21. There's no reason for experimentation. We've got too many drivers out there being assaulted, being dragged out of their seats and beat up. This comes down to democracy, and we'll see how the vote turns out. Certainly, it's not everything the union wanted, but it should keep mass transit moving in these crucial months ahead. Hudson WCCO, 4 News. Now, because of worker shifts, voting will continue until 4 o'clock Monday afternoon. Those results will be known tomorrow night.